Hey, it's Courtney Lynn. So, um, it is Monday the 9th, and yesterday was Easter. Hope everybody had a really good Easter and got to spend time with their families. My parents live about two hours away from my sister and I, and um, they came down, and we all went to my sister's and had dinner, and it was really good. Um, I kind of ate what I wanted. I just didn't eat much. Um, and then we all actually went to a park near my house, and... Me and my sister and my mom all played tennis, and I have a little bit of footage of that, so we'll go ahead and watch that for a minute. <laughs> it made it over eventually. <laughs> it made it over eventually. These are my first two guest stars. Nice, kind of. Oh, that one's in. <laughs> so it's Courtney versus mom. It's actually a pretty good volley, guys. So you guys actually kept it going for a couple minutes. Say hi. Okay, get serious here. Mom with the serve. And Courtney with the return to the other court. <laughs> that looks like it's coming towards me. Oh, it is. Okay, so it was an interesting day yesterday. Um, I mean, everything was really good, seeing the family and everything. Um, found out two people that are pretty close to me are pregnant <laughs> in one day. Within like three hours, I found out about both of them. So, um, excited about both of them, but I thought I'd take a minute to talk about you know, like the jealousy, that kind of thing with um, not being able to get pregnant. And when we were first trying, it was really hard. And it seems that I, I must be just at that age where everyone around me is having babies, getting married, starting families, um, some even having second or third children. And um, it was really, really, really hard for me at first. Um, I don't know if it's just it's gotten easier or... Um, since I know what it is with the PCOS and, um, you know, I feel like that I know what to do to make it happen. You know, there's no guarantee, but it's something that I can work towards and I know what the issue is. So I think maybe that's what it is. And with, you know, being in the midst of dieting and all that, um, I actually was legitimately just happy. Like there was no jealousy. There was no questioning anything like that I was legitimately just happy for both of them um so you both know who you are and congratulations and um neither one of them were 
planned, which is another crazy thing. I, a lot of pregnancies that have happened since I've been trying have been planned. Neither one of these were planned, so it's actually super surprising that I'm completely happy about it and not jealous. But um, anyways, I know that is a really tough thing with not being able to get pregnant with the jealousy. So um, I don't know. Um, so goals for this week, I'm failing at not eating carbs. <laughs> I mean, I'm still losing and it's not happening like super fast, but I just really need to cut back the carbs, which is really hard for me. I'm a complete carbaholic and yeah, I need, I need to get my focus and self-control really into check. So, um, the tennis was a great, great workout yesterday. I am legitimately very sore. Um, and was going to go walking today. It seems like every time I make plans on Monday, it doesn't happen. But um, it's supposed to rain right about the time that um, me and my, this girl that I used to work with, um, we were going to go walking and um, take our dogs and stuff. So it's supposed to rain, so we're just going to reschedule it for another time. But, um, yeah. I want to try to do different things this week, kind of the whole shock system, shock my system, um, and really get the exercise going in my favor. Sorry, hair on my eye. But um, I think that's about it, and I will see you guys on Wednesday. Have a good day.